Recently, we have seen an incredible surge in new frameworks and tools that are being integrated within Cloud Code that drastically improve performance and efficiency. Tools like Claudia have enhanced the overall GUI experience, while innovations like Cloudflow have introduced advanced orchestration agent systems that overall improve quality of output and manage token expenditure more intelligently. These updates signal a huge leap forward for Cloud Code as a coding assistant, but there's still one critical limitation, and that is AI code reviews, which is a remaining weak spot within Cloud Code. And this is due to certain restrictions within Cloud Code. Performing detailed code base aware reviews is still quite challenging. That's exactly why I want to introduce a new solution that can supercharge Cloud Code further for code reviews, and that is with Code Rabbit. Code Rabbit is an AI powered review platform designed to help software teams as well as developers ship better quality code in half the time with dramatically fewer bugs. And the best part is, it's free. It automates much of the traditional manual code review process, which is going to allow you to focus on more feature development and less tedious review tasks. What makes CodeRabbit especially powerful is its ability to perform fine-tuned reviews based on user feedback and configurable instructions. It offers line-by-line codebase-aware reviews. It includes a one-click fix and integrates seamlessly within Cloud Code and its environment you'll be able to see a full list of changed files along with one-line summaries of every change right directly within Claude. And on top of that, CodeRabbit lets you visualize code flows, validate link issues, as well as find related PRs, add labels, and choose relevant reviews, all of which combine to help you ship faster, more confidently. And for those who do not know what Cloud Code is, it's an agentic coding tool that lives directly within your terminal, understands your code base, and helps you code faster by executing routine tasks. And this is something that was created by Anthropic. So imagine having the ability to work with your code base with agentic capabilities with Cloud Code, and then having it combined with CodeRabbit can essentially help you deploy code much faster, which is why I'm showcasing it today. Now, CodeRabbit also has another tool which lets you deploy it straight within GitLab or GitHub. And you can get started with the free trial, but what we're gonna be doing is using their free tool which integrates within an IDE like VS Code, Cursor, or even something like Windsurf. So what I want you to do first is go ahead and install it within whatever IDE you want. This is where we're gonna have it integrated within Cloud Code directly within our IDE. Before we get started, I just want to mention that you should definitely go ahead and subscribe to the World of AI newsletter. I'm constantly posting different newsletters on a weekly basis. So this is where you can easily get up to date knowledge about what is happening in the AI space. So definitely go ahead and subscribe as this is completely for free. After installing, I want you to go ahead and create an account completely for free. And then you can go ahead and open up your workspace to start reviewing code with CodeRabbit but then we're gonna have it integrated with Cloud Code, which is where after you create an account with CodeRabbit, you can then install the other prerequisite, which is obviously having Cloud Code installed. And to do so, you simply just need to have Node.js 18 or above, and then run the following npm install command within your terminal. So in this case, you would open up whatever terminal you wanna use for your operating system. So in this case, I'm using WSL because I'm on Windows. And then I'm gonna go ahead and paste in the npm install command, which will go ahead and install this. Now what I can do is have it integrate with CodeRabbit. And to do that, it's super simple. Head over to the CodeRabbit extension within the ID you have it installed, and then head over to the settings tab. Once you are here for the CodeRabbit agent type, this is where you can have it so that you can keep it as Cloud Code. And then once you have integrated with Cloud Code, you can also have it so that the CodeRabbit auto review mode could be set to prompt or something like automatically starting reviews after commits. But we're gonna leave it as the base default as prompt. And once that is done, you can go ahead and close this. Now it's super simple. Within a new terminal, you can go ahead and open up whatever uh, terminal you would like, and then you can open up Cloud Code directly within the IDE, and it's gonna be then linked with our CodeRabbit integration. Afterwards, within the CodeRabbit extensions, just simply go ahead and open up a workspace, which is where you have the ability to manage all your files a part of your workspace. You have Cloud Code on the bottom, and then you also have an integrated AI chat panel. This is essentially where you can ask questions about the context that you have provided, 
You can even add individual contexts. You can even use different agents like an ask agent, and then you can configure different models that you can use. This way, you're going to be able to even configure tools as well as having the ability to work with MCP servers with code reviews. So this is as easy as this. To review all of your code, you can review all the changes with a single click with CodeRabbit. This is where it's going to then start reviewing and it's going to actually use Claude code and helping us do this. First, it looks like it's initializing and reviewing all the different individual files. And if there is any sort of file that needs adjustment or edits, it's going to use Claude code to help review and edit with different agents, which is just awesome. So you can see right now it's setting up everything and then analyzing the changes. And then afterwards, it'll review all the files individually, step by step, which is just awesome. And you can see in real time all the different reviews that it is pointing out. And you can see that in certain areas, there is a potential issue as well as a refractor suggestion. And if I'm to actually individually click on the file, it'll take me over to the diff edits that are potentially supposed to be implemented to fix the code. Now, if I'm to actually close the panel, you can actually see a full breakdown of the potential issue and the refractor suggestion. And in this case, if you wanna approve this fix, like clearing the container that removes the chart, also hardened parsing. And if you wanna approve it, you can go ahead and apply the suggested change by simply clicking on this button. And you can see that it will rapidly implement it to that individual file. And within minutes, you can see that it was able to find all the 41 issues. And you can see that there's actually a ability to actually resolve all of them using the agent itself. And it is also using the Claude code agent to help you accomplish this. So if it's something like giving the loading container an ID, et cetera, et cetera. It is providing the refractor suggestion and the new code that was generated was fully integrated. Say if you want Claude code specifically to work on this review over here, you can click on fix with AI. This is where it's gonna open up Claude code and help you accomplish this task. Right now, we need to have it integrated and have it logged in within Claude code. So I'm going to go ahead and sign in with an account with Anthropic so that we can fix that particular issue with Claude Code. So you can see right now that it has gotten the context from CodeRabbit and it is working on implementing different fixes for all the different files that CodeRabbit was able to find a potential fix for. And you can see a potential problem for Claude Code right now is wanting to make the necessary changes and looks like it has fixed and updated that particular file with the necessary changes that were needed. In the same way, you can go ahead and review through all the different refactoring suggestions that CodeRabbit has found. And this way you can have Claude Code individually focus on fixing with AI or using their chatbot, which is where you have the free agent that uses the Claude Sonnet 315 or other state-of-the-art models to help you resolve certain issues. If you like this video and would love to support the channel, you can consider donating to my channel through the super thanks option below. Or you can consider joining our private Discord where you can access multiple subscriptions to different AI tools for free on a monthly basis, plus daily AI news and exclusive content, plus a lot more. That is the true capability of combining CodeRabbit and supercharging Claude Code with it. This is a great way to handle intelligent line by line code reviews right inside your IDE while Claude Code acts as the backend agent that applies smart context aware fixes directly through the terminal. And once configured, you can trigger Claude Code through CodeRabbit to fix different sorts of issues. And with a single click of a button, like you saw, it's able to bring the power of full code base understanding and automation to your daily workflow. Thanks to CodeRabbit, you're going to be able to instantly and drastically change the amount of time it takes to review code and you're going to be able to ship way faster. So I highly recommend that you use this extension with Cloud Code as it's going to supercharge Cloud Code and it's going to help your development time by cutting it in half. But with that thought, guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video and got something out of this. This is a free tool that you can easily use. So I highly recommend that you try this out. Make sure you subscribe to the second channel, join the newsletter, join the Discord, follow me on Twitter. And lastly, make sure you guys subscribe, turn on the notification bell, 
like this video and please take a look at our previous videos because there is a lot of content that you will truly benefit from. But with that thought, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Have an amazing day. Spread positivity and I'll see you guys fairly shortly. Peace out, fellas.